Hello, this is Stack Coaster Enthusiast, and I'll be doing a step step guide on how to install mods for Planet Coaster. So, first, you want to join this Discord server. It's called Planet Coaster Mod Hub. This is where you'll find all of the mods. You'll also find updates to the mods, and you have a nice chat with some awesome people. So, um, obviously, read the rules. Um, first thing you do is you go into Mod Releases. Then, this is where you download all of the mods. So, first of all, to install the main mod which is realism free you want to scroll all the way up and see this message and you want to click on mod manager that's when you want release uh, so you download this file and then just open it and extract it to wherever you want you will need to keep this to install for your mods or you can delete it after Next off, you want to go and look at, well yeah, if there's any other mods you want, then you can look in here, there's Arrow Looper Decal, there's some few mods on Nexus mods, although not all of them actually work. So here is the mod that you, there's like the main one, so this is 1 meter, remove track limits. So if you download this, you'll see it is a PCM file. This is a file specifically made for the mod manager. and it will get recognized by it so if you go here you'll see PC mod manager you, it says please select your planet coaster installation folder so watch carefully if you go into your, where your steam is located go into steam apps common then find your planet coaster and then just select that folder there So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to install Realism Free. What you do is you click Open, and here we go. It might look like it's crashed. I just keep it down there while it's installing, and just leave it running. It looks like it's crashing, but it, what it will do is it will spam text, and that means it is working and it's downloading the mod. Now we're going to install the other type of mod, which is called ACSE. This is a simpler type of mod to install. Also, just while I have it here, I would not recommend downloading Invisible Doodads. It has caused issues with people's games. Although, if you want to take the risks, then I'd recommend backing up your files 